really there like I am him. being like, oh yeah, I don't really wear hoodies. Yeah, don't yeah, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Don't like these. I'm, like, I'm talking like rubbish. I'm literally holding them up, and I would say there's not even an inch difference. I've got the matching set, so I've got the hoodie as well. Because I just wear them all around the house, and you need to put your phone in your pocket or some food or. God, I just. That was the right boob shot that was when I just started recording my. Was it? Well, not that I got anything to shot. But... Boob shot. Boob, boob shot. shot. Yeah. Talking of boobs, I'll just push my bar up a little bit because it looks like I've got saggy boobs. Not what you want, not what anyone no. wants. Right, should we start? Yeah. Three and a two and a one. Hello guys! <laughs> Welcome back to our channel. Today we've got a really exciting, well we say that every time but. <laughs> yeah we actually do. Today this one's really exciting. So we've got um, an in the style haul but it is Sid and Al's collection isn't yes. it? We're so excited about this. I have been I've literally watched Sid and Elle for years and I'm yeah. a big fan of them, so yeah. I'm really excited about this. Yes. Me too. And so, the stuff that they, I actually think I got, I don't actually know, because I did an order. I, I was really panicky on the order because it wouldn't recognise my address. So I literally yeah. ordered everything that I wanted and then I went back on and I got another thing. So I'm pretty sure we were together, maybe like five things. I tried to get four, but when I went to my basket to check out, one of them had sold out and then I got too scared yeah. to go back and find something else in case the things that I had in my basket then sold out as well. So I was like, yeah. right, you know, I'm just gonna get three things because yeah, it was it was quite it was quite stressful. It's always stressful when like an influencer does like a collab with a brand and you try to get any of the products. Like yeah. it's it's always really stressful because everyone just goes on and buys it, don't they? So Exactly, yeah, it was it was very stressful because and as well I was trying to make a homemade Nando's and my alarm went off to say like you need to go on in the sun I was like oh my god like trying to like cook this chicken and then I was like oh god I need to go on the website and Ellis was like what what are you doing and I was like it's an emergency I need to order something I need to order something yeah so I'm really excited to see what these are like yeah me too I'm really excited I haven't actually really had a look to be honest and you only got uh, yours mean, today, didn't you? I only got mine today, yeah. I got it today. Because basically, for some reason, on this, it was really weird. So basically, I got it delivered to an Asda near me um, just because like it didn't recognise my address on the website. So when I was on the app, it wouldn't recognise my postcode. So I was like, right, I'll just get it delivered to a store because I was panicking. I was like, it's going to go out of stock. Let's just go pick it up. It's fine. So I've been waiting. It said it was going to be next day. So it was going to arrive the next day. And I ordered this like last Wednesday, I think. Or it said it was going to be shipped last Wednesday. So then it'd be there the Thursday I mean we are now Tuesday and I still hadn't had an email to say that it had arrived at Asda so I was like to Wizzy I was like right I'm just gonna go because if they have it there and then I don't collect it then they're gonna send it they're back to them in the back, style yeah. aren't they and yeah. I don't want that to happen so I went to Asda today and went up to the desk and I was like oh hi I think I have an order to collect but I haven't had an um, email to say that I can come pick it up but I just thought I'd come and check just in case because it said it'd be next day she was like oh okay what's the order number so I gave her the order number she was like oh that's weird I'll just um I'll just go and grab them so she went to grab them and she came back and she was like so are you have you have you mar have you married like do you have a maiden name do you have like a different name I was like no why she was like well it says that the name is null I was like Oh, I think that means that there's like no name. Like, I don't think that. I don't, <laughs> yeah, I was like, I don't think that's a name. Like, I think it just says like null. Like, there's no name. Um, so for some reason, in the style, didn't put my name on the order, and I think that's why they didn't check my the thing yeah. in and email me because it was yeah. all just a bit confusing. But anyway, I got the order. Your name is Miss Null. It's official. My yeah, my name is now Miss Null. <laughs> That is so funny, honestly. Imagine if you just left it though, and it would have just gone back, and you wouldn't have even known that it had gone back. Actually, I'm so glad I went today because otherwise, yeah, it might have gone back, and then I would have been so gutted because I, yeah, exactly. I bet it would have just gone out of stock again. I think this is like the shacket because I, I basically this is I ordered the shacket after I'd ordered the other stuff, so I think this is shacket. So I'll open this yeah. one first. Oh wait, I was wrong. This is shacket. I was really really liked a lot of the stuff um yeah i i could have like if it had been in stock i probably could have bought quite a lot but i was like no i'll just get three select things yeah. and see what it's like but i liked basically all of it to be honest i don't know about yeah, you so but yeah. yeah everything like all of the items were nice weren't they yeah, i'm just really. gonna like i'm just gonna do this the whole style of it is very like i don't know if we, me and you have really different styles but i feel yeah. like we both like it so yeah oh my god what the hell why is there, oh, is don't tell me the window cleaner's there again. No, I've got some sort of music video going on in the background. 
I tried to put a nice little fireplace on in the background again on my Mac, so, but I think that was an ad, so sorry if you can see a music video in the background <laughs> rather than a fireplace. Right, should I go first? Yep, go first. Okay, go so what is this? Oh, I think this is the quarter zip. I think we both got this, didn't we? Oh, yeah, yeah. Actually, I tell a lie. I said I didn't look at anything, but I did actually get this out because I was really excited about this. Really excited. So I got yeah. mine in a size 12. This is basically just like an acid wash quarter zip and it says yeah. Miami Beach on it. It so. is a bit of me. Like acid it wash, is. quarter yeah. zip, oversized yeah. jumper. That's just a bit of me, really. Definitely. That is, it's kind of you in a jumper, isn't it? It is, yeah. Um, I, I got, got mine in a 10. Yeah, I got mine in a 12. I was going to get mine in a 14 because I wanted to be, it to be like really big, but the 14 yeah. had sold out. All, of the, all the big sizes sold out really quickly, I thought. Yeah, I feel like it's probably because, but then I think it said on the description oversized, like I'm holding this up yeah. and this is by no way like a true to size, size 10. No. So no. if, I don't know, if it's not sold out or if it comes back or anything just for reference for anyone, yeah. like the things that, oh, well, this is definitely oversized anyway. Like yeah. you can see that is going to, it's probably going to be how i would want it to fit to be honest yeah, so 100%, yeah. like it's really quite it's quite wide isn't it yeah i just really like it it's oh, kind of like a bluey gray color isn't it i would yeah. say because yeah. i mean my oh sorry my trousers are gray and this is like yeah it looks blue compared to it but yeah you know what yeah. i mean you know what i mean you know what i mean okay and here is the quarter zip that we both have um i literally love this it's the perfect kind of oversized fit that i would like um i love the color it's it looks quite blue on camera and it does compare to these jobs as well obviously you would not wear these together um unless you want to be really comfy <laughs> but yeah it definitely looks more i would say like navy acid wash um but yeah you could kind of like wear it off the shoulder like really chilled obviously you can do this up as well but yeah love it really nice um if i wasn't to bunch it up it comes down quite far on me as well so yeah i really like the fit of this love it i feel like it feels really good quality as well doesn't it mm -hmm. really nice okay so it turns out i don't think i'm going to be taking anything back from this haul because i love this as well i've just paired it with like a jump this is a jumpsuit from pretty little thing and um, but i've just topped popped it over the top with the zip undone and i've just kind of like slouched it over to the side um but yeah i literally love this as well <laughs> oh no my bank account is going to absolutely hate me so my next item is so my actually my next two are trousers or like joggers so i got this pair which look really nice yeah. they are like the gray um with i don't know i'd kind of describe that as like i don't know it's like a muted sort of blue color on the side of panels i got these in a 10 because i wanted them to be like really comfy these probably aren't the kind of thing that i would like go out in because they they actually look quite big like i think i don't think they're going to do a lot for me shall we say okay um <laughs> But they, I knew, I could see they had a drawstring, so I knew that I could like obviously cinch the waist in if they were a bit bigger. But yeah, yeah. they, these would, de I would definitely say these are bigger. These are an oversized size ten as well. So okay. I would. They're, they're nice though, aren't they? Like hundred percent, like really nice. Yeah, they yeah. go in really nicely at the bottom. Like you know when you know that they're going to be tight on your ankle, yeah. whereas sometimes they're like yeah. baggy and yeah. they're nice and like fleecy and soft inside as well. Oh, the colours are described as charcoal and dusty blue. So oh, there you go then. Were there any yeah. matching items for these? I don't know. Was there a matching yeah, jumper? I think that was a hoodie. I think that was a hoodie. Yeah. yeah. I don't know why I'm not, not on the hoodie hive at the moment. I either want a sweatshirt or I want a quarter zip. I'm just not yeah. feeling hoodies at the moment. So that's no, probably I'm why I didn't get either. it. But yeah, that is why I didn't get really? the matching one. But really nice. Really nice and soft. And they feel like they're going to be really comfy. So that is the main thing. Okay, so here are the joggers. Um... I oh, can't get my hand in the pocket. <laughs> um, I've literally just put it on with like a black crop. But yeah, these are really comfy, really, really oversized. I have pulled them in quite a lot, but um, they're still quite baggy on the way. So I don't think I can do it anymore. But <laughs> yeah, they are really oversized and comfy. But I have also noticed that mine have got some kind of stain on them. So not great, but that's not a stain I put on them. <laughs> but yeah, they are really, really comfy. Really nice. Right, okay. <laughs> What have I got? Oh yeah, I was really excited about this one. So I picked up the, um, did you see this? It was like the cropped shirt. It was like a cropped jacket in a way. Um, so this is a really, really nice color. It's like a sort of like beigey color mixed with that kind of like that muted blue that Izzy was just talking about. And it's basically just like a cropped 
sort of like shacket it's thicker than a shirt would be it's not like a flannel shirt it's like a shacket material but it's cropped and it's got little buttons down the middle and then a little pleat detail at the back um but yeah it's really nice really nice and soft i can literally already tell when you're holding the colors up that it's gonna suit you like the colors well really yeah no i i just thought like this would be really cool with like i don't know a pair of like ribbed leggings or something like that or even just like a pair of jeans or something i thought it looked really cool but um yeah, really excited about that. What would you wear that. underneath? Um, to be honest, probably like a little crop. Or I'd even just wear it as like a shirt, like a sh like buttoned up as a shirt, maybe with some leggings and some boots or something. I think that looked quite cool. Um, but I got this in a size 12. Yeah, got this in a size 12. I wouldn't say it's like really oversized. I think it's probably true to size. Like yeah. on top, I'm usually probably like a 10, I would say. Um, but and I, this was... I would say it, it looks like a baggy fit, but yeah. not like... Exactly. Uh, exactly. Yeah, you can see, like, the arms are kind of yeah. Like, but yeah. Like, I feel like this will be big on me, but it's going to be big because I got a size bigger. It's not going to be big because it's an oversized fit, if you know what I mean. Yeah. So, yeah, really nice. Really excited to try that one on. Yeah. Okay, yeah, really loving this as well, guys. Obviously, I said I'd wear it with jeans. I do think it looks really cute with jeans. Um, it's really nice and oversized and like boxy if you know what i mean so it's not fitted at all it's super boxy fit um and yeah i just really like it really nice and soft as well um so yeah good quality love it right this is my third and um, final item actually oh just love i'm so getting into like the whole chocolate brown vibe oh yeah Did um I get these as well so these oh, no, are these are, they're like the wide leg, they're wide leg joggers, so you can see they are pretty wide actually. So it's look, it, the colour, interesting, the colour looks really red on camera. Um, yeah. It's definitely like a true like chocolate brown, but from what I'm seeing on camera, it looks like it's coming up as more of like a ready brown, which it's not. Um, yeah, but yeah, these, I got these in an eight. Um, I wouldn't actually say, looking at these and these, there is very much difference at all. Really? Oh no, there's maybe I was going to say, what bit. do you think is going to fit you better? Do you think the chocolate one? I mean, there's literally nothing in it. I would say, I'm literally holding them up and I would say there's not even an inch difference. Oh my God. Um, they're all just quite baggy and oversized yeah. fit, I think. So yeah. these are probably going to fit me fine as well. But they've got pockets, which I love in some Lovely. joggers. Because I just wear them all around the house and you need to put your phone in your pocket or some food or... Some food. <laughs> anything just like that. a snack. Just a snack, yeah. <laughs> um, they do look quite long. I'm just going to quickly hold them up and see. Oh, no, they might be all right, actually. Yeah. Um, if you were short, okay. I don't think they would be all right. Okay. Um, me and you would probably be all right because we're... Yeah. Oh, no, we're not tall, but we're taller. But if you were like 5'3 yeah. or something, I think these would be dragging on the floor. But yeah. We will see. And they look like they're going to sit really nice and high, actually, as well. If you look up oh, the difference between, like, here and the top of the waistband. So, yeah. Very soft nice. and comfy again. So, yeah. Nice very impressed with those, actually. And here are the chocolate joggers. Yeah, I love these. Really nice. They fit me a lot better than the other joggers, but these are an eight. So, but they're still nice and they're not tight in any way. They are really quite long. So, I um, could not wear these out because they go well over my foot and... I'm not particularly short, so I think you would struggle if you were short, but they're really nice. Really nice and comfy. Yeah. Love the colour. I just realised I did get them as well. Ooh, so I, I also got these. I got these in a size 12 um, yeah. because I wanted them to be a bit oversized. And like I said, they've they, got a drawstring. They, they look quite, they look quite so big. Too. They do look quite big, yeah. I yeah. feel like maybe if you can cinch them in at the waist with the drawstring, they'll be okay. Yeah. But... Yeah, they're cute though. I like them. So I just realised I've, I've got the matching set. So I've got the hoodie as well. Mm, there nice. I am being like, oh yeah, I don't really wear hoodies. Yeah, don't, really, don't really like hoodies. I'm, I'm talking load of rubbish. So I got the uh, matching hoodie, which says oh, Miami yeah, Beach on it. And then that goes with the joggers. So actually, I probably would wear this out of the house because you've got a matching yeah, set there. Matching. Yeah, exactly. So um, I got the top in a 12 as well. So that's going to be nice and oversized, but it's huge. Mm -hmm. It actually is very big. This is definitely is, oversized, big. really yeah. big, but I love the colour. Look. And really? see, that would look really nice, like a massive hoodie and then like yeah. tighter bottoms, like a tight, yeah. tight leggings or something like that would look really exactly. nice. Yes. Yeah. So really like that. I'm going to try that on. Yeah. The Miami Beach bit is in like a sort of um, nudie colour, by the way. It's not white. It's in like a nudie colour. So it goes really nice yeah. next to the... Um, yeah, chocolate. It white on, it yeah it does doesn't it i just realized yeah. that but it's in like a nude color so it looks really nice next to the chocolate but yeah mm -hmm. really nice 
Okay, guys, this is absolutely a bit of me. This is amazing. I love it. It's so comfy, so oversized. I'm 100% I would wear it out. Obviously, these are nice and wide leg. Please excuse my socks. When I've got shoes on, they won't be as sort of long. Um, but I literally love it. It's such good quality. The colours are amazing. And yeah, definitely keeping this one. Uh, next, what have I got? Oh yeah, here's the shacket. God, I'm excited for this. This is your final item. Yeah, this is my final item. She literally me. And she was like, oh, we were like, oh, we've done the orders yet. And then she was like, oh, I've just gone back on there and ordered the shacket. And I was like, oh my God. <laughs> oh God, okay. Look, I've seen some people wearing it and I really need it. <laughs> to be fair, like, I actually don't own a shacket. Like, uh, the whole shacket trend has kind of been, hasn't it? But I don't own a shacket. And they're just really nice to chuck on things, like over the top of things, aren't they? Because they're quite warm and thick. I definitely but... feel like they will be making a comeback in like, yeah, spring. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. And I feel like they'll be in next year as well. They're just like a thing now, aren't they? Yeah. So, um, I remember when they sold out everywhere. Oh my God, yeah. Everyone went mad for them, didn't they? Absolutely yeah. mad for them. They just sold out right. everywhere. You couldn't get yeah. them anywhere. Um, but yeah, this is a sort of like, you've got like navy blue, light blue, and then a really light sort of cream color and it's long so it's a really long jacket um yeah. i remember seeing like this girl at my uni she was wearing a really long one and she wore it with um some leggings a t like a little like ribbed top and then some really chunky boots and she just looked mm. so cool and i was like wow i need like a long jacket um yeah. so yeah that's why i got that yeah, so nice. it's really thick like it feels really good quality um and mm. it's also very soft as well so it keeps me nice and warm nice and yeah. warm in the cold months Love that. Because apparently nice. we've got a storm coming. Have you heard? Oh, great. Yeah, a storm like Christopher or something. Or oh. like Craig or something to get to see. <laughs> storm <laughs> Craig! Oh, brilliant. <laughs> Fun Craig. Um, so that'll keep me nice and warm in the colder yeah. months. And the lovely cosy jacket. This is so nice. Really soft. It's very loud though. <laughs> the buttons are really, really loud. Sounds like I'm like shaking maracas or something. But it's nonetheless, it's really, really nice. Like a nice length. I feel like with some nice chunky boots. Uh, it's nice and warm, like really thick. Um, I like the split hem here as well. Um, but yeah, really lovely. But yeah, hopefully, um, I was actually going to say, I don't know if anyone can give us any feedback on how we film like our try on clips. Yeah. Whether, because obviously, like at this moment in time, oh, I've got an itch, sorry. At this moment in time, neither of us have tried anything on. So yeah. I feel like we try and make it come across on the try and clips, whether we like it or not. But it's not always, oh my God, I've got really itchy nose. <laughs> it's not as obvious whether we like it or not. I'm always kind of like in the mirror, like, yeah, I like it. Yeah. But yeah. whether, like, you'd prefer if we maybe spoke over the try on clips or, yeah, what? So maybe. Yeah, maybe, maybe could, in this one we'll speak and I'll try and. Yeah, clip. maybe, we'll, or yeah, yeah give us some feedback. What you prefer. What you prefer. Yeah. Give yeah. us some feedback. Because mm -hmm. you probably do want to know if we like it or not. And mm -hmm. it's, it might not be as obvious if we're just like, woo, or like, it's don't like it. It's cool to tell whether something fits well because. When um, we done our Zara haul, the jeans actually really didn't fit me very well at all. But then yeah. when I watched the try on clip back, they looked like they did. They so like yeah, um, yeah, and they, they weren't comfy, but you guys wouldn't know that. So maybe just yeah. give us some feedback on our, how that's you like me. us to film it and how. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's a good shout actually. But yeah, I'm really impressed with that. It was, if anyone yeah, managed to get too. their hands on anything, let us know what you managed to get because yeah. It was a really nice collection. The stuff feels really good quality. I never really yeah. know with it in the style if stuff's gonna be good quality or not because I don't really regularly <laughs> order from there. No, I don't really, or I, like I've, I love Lorna Lux's collection, as we all know, and I order her stuff from there and I the, her stuff's always really good quality. So I assumed that this would be as well, and it is. Yeah. It's lived up to expectations, so. We also just want to say that we are thankful for hitting 1,000 subscribers. We hit it today. We hit 1,000 this morning. This morning. So Obviously, this will be going up on Sunday, and today is Tuesday, so it'll be a bit yeah. delayed. So hopefully, we might have a few more by then. But um, yeah, thank you to everyone who has subscribed so far. It literally means the world to us. We were so excited. So that's so really, excited. really good news to hit like such a big milestone. And I can remember not even that long ago, it doesn't feel like really that we hit like 100 and we were really excited yeah, about it so exactly, yeah like obviously um, it's, it's not a, it's not a big milestone compared to some other people but, it's, yeah. but for us it's a huge milestone because it's been such a tough year filming when obviously we've been in lockdown so for us it's just a huge milestone and we're honestly grateful for every single person that's sub subscribed yeah, and everyone who supported us hard work into it don't we we yeah. obviously obviously you're not unfortunately in the moment but we both do have jobs as well obviously um and don't live together or really that close to each other so even yeah. when we were yeah, we put a lot of effort into it, so we really appreciate everyone who supported us. 
Yes. Um, so yeah, it's really exciting. Thank you so much. If you haven't already, uh, please do make sure that you subscribe to our channel uh, to support us. Yeah, and leave us, leave us, leave us, <laughs> leave us. <laughs> leave us a like and a comment down below as well um, and give us some feedback like I said about the try and clip as well so yes. yes but we will see you next Sunday for another video another haul basically another haul, yeah. <laughs> yeah another haul basically which includes this top that I'm wearing so yeah if you want to see more it includes like some really cute stuff really cute so. and a lot of it's a big haul isn't it a lot yeah, of stuff yeah, yeah. so yeah if you want to see that then um, make sure you stick around for next week's video and turn on notifications on as well so you don't miss exactly. out yeah, just do all that. Just do yeah, everything. just do everything. Just do it all. <laughs> okay, yeah. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next, see you week. next week. Bye. Baby.